Hey guys, welcome back to my garden. It's super early in the morning and I'm about to turn my lights on, but before doing so, I wanted to record a quick episode just to show you guys how things are looking. If you want to check out the previous episode, please check that out, this way you can see just how fast the plants have grown and get a nice little comparison. Now looking around, you see the plants look really good, they look very healthy I think, and they look super good honestly, I mean there's not much to say. Let's come in a little bit closer, you guys can see what's going on. The loose leaf lettuce you can see is already getting nice and bushy and compact. You can see, look at all of these beautiful colors. Just let me shut up for just a quick moment. Amazing. And look at the root system, it's poking out like crazy going up. The reason why it's coming out so much up above here is because I pulled up all of these grow cubes. If you check out the previous episode, you'll you understand why. But the plants are doing really well, guys. They look really healthy. They look really good. And if I wanted to, honestly, I could probably make myself a tiny little baby salad here by taking off probably like one or two leaves here, 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 a couple here and there. Maybe take one of these little basil leaves. Man, this basil is incredible. This is not standard basil. This is a basil lettuce leaf. So it's going to look super compact and bushy, kind of like what lettuce looks like. Um, sort of how... Maybe not, but you get the point. It's not exactly what ba traditional basil looks like, so I'm really excited to try that out. I don't know what it tastes like, but smelling my fingers after rubbing it, it smells phenomenal. And it looks like a couple of these guys are not doing too great, like this one here. This one here is bouncing back, and this one came back a lot, that was about the size of that one. So probably in about a day or two, or a couple, I'm sorry, not a day or two, in about a week or so, it should bounce back and get a little bit larger. So I'm not going to pull it out just yet, but let me lift up the container here, we guys could take a look. Check out the root system here. I mean, tell me that's not beautiful. So you could see, because I pulled up the... The grow cubes here now, they are flush with the board over here, so I think that's where I need it to be initially. So, whoops, that's mistake number one. Mistake number two, you can see the algae here is growing along the edge of the board. Inside the container looks really clean and healthy, which is great. So I'm going to just take a, probably like a, a little tissue with some alcohol on it and just wipe all of this algae off. That'll probably kill it and stop it in its place. And then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to most likely, t until I get a permanent solution, I'll probably take like a little cloth and just tape it along the edge of the board here all the way around with just a little bit of a flap coming down this way. Or maybe a piece of paper I could even tape down just kind of on both ends. That'll hold it down, but then the problem with that is I need to open it up here and there to inspect what the roots look like. So we'll see, I'm, tr I'm trying a couple options for a permanent solution. I got a couple things that I'm working on, we'll see. In about a week or two, I should have a permanent solution, guys. But other than that, it's doing really well. The second board down here has been is also doing really well. Not as large as the, the plant growth up above, but the plants above were growing a lot longer. I would say almost a week longer than the ones down here below. So these are the new babies down here. You can see they're looking really healthy, really good. They kind of look like what the last episode looked like. So that's a great little comparison of before and after. So you could already tell if I had a third board, which you know I do have the setup here and I have even a fourth one up above, but I'm not gonna work on that until much later. But the third one's coming really soon, guys. I got the veggies going. I finally got these things in the mail. Not the right row cubes, but at least the containers are super nice. And that's gonna make it nice and easy for, for watering and just pulling things up and draining up excess water down below. I don't know why it took so long to get that. So that's work in the works, waiting for the air stones to come in. A couple of things are, are going to change as well as, um, I'm testing out the light system here. You could see I, uh, the distance here that I have, I'm using the original hooks that I came with. And the ones down below here, it's a little bit higher up just to see if it is higher, if you know higher up works just as well, I might as well, I'm going to pull up both ends of the of the grow lights here, I'm going to pull this one up and I'm going to pull the one up above here. This way I get a little bit more grow space and the lettuce could grow a little bit taller. So other than that, things are doing really well guys. This is just a really quick and super easy episode. 
and we'll be back soon for more. If you like the episode, show me some love. Hit that thumbs up, guys. Post any messages or comments down below. I'll do my best to respond. But before we go, tell me how beautiful this looks, man. Look at this. I don't know. I come in every morning, or every morning. I work out of the house now, so I come in throughout the day. And I'm just in awe of how things look here. Absolutely gorgeous. I'm not sure if I checked out the roots down here below, but let's look, take a look at that before we, do, before we go. Man, look at that red. So looking good guys, looking really, really good. I couldn't be happier. I'll see you guys back for more. Thanks for watching.